wonder if there's a gold Gardramon here. No, it's just a regular Gardramon. Uh, maybe I can do something with this town later. When there are bridges here. <laughs> yes? Okay. Oh, and there's Rika and Hamari. Yay! What does Rika have to say? <laughs> okay, let's take the uh, the travel, the traveler route. You know. Let me see where Wizardmon will send me to next. No, thank you. Actually, let me see if I have the items. Do I have an autopilot? Yes, I do. I have plenty to spare. Mod cave. I could just walk over there, but right now I'm short on time. I actually have to go return a television that doesn't seem to be working well. And then after that, I have plenty more to do. One more time, Yukimura! Yeah. Exhaust flame! Come on! You won't get stronger than anybody with an effort like that! They've been like this since I arrived. Training like they're possessed. You can tell just from looking. Yukimura isn't up to this, but even using force, I don't think I could stop. I know I'm not setting a great example, but I need to ask you to put a stop to it. Don't try and stop us. This is Yukimura's and my problem to solve. Hey, what's the matter, Yukimura? You done already? No, not yet. That's right. Do your best, Yukimura. We'll be stronger than anyone else out there. We decided we'd do whatever it takes. Even if that means altering our form. Kota... If that's what you want, I'll... Not good. Brace yourself, Yukimura! As long as you don't lose your will, all that power can be yours! Yeah, this Kota guy doesn't know what the hell he's doing. Yukimura! What are you doing? Knock that curse into submission! version of Skull Greymon. What? Why? That's not Machine Draymon. <laughs> Yukimura! Okay, quick thoughts. Um, yeah, this is totally Tai Kamiya Yagami from Digimon Adventure. This is totally his situation. Yeah, where he tried to push his own Digimon so that he could get stronger. Nice and calm. He tried to well, he forcefully evolve his Digimon into the okay. next step. Which didn't really work out for him, and it's not really enough for Yukimura either. That's right. I mean, uh, Yukimura and Kota. Good hit. So yeah, um, right. we're gonna have an easier time fighting him because he's a dark Digimon and we're using light powers. That's right. Good aim. And if I can use the double attack, I can end this quick. Watch carefully. That's just like that. Watch carefully. Okay, let's go for it. That's right. Nice. Watch carefully. That's right. <laughs> Thank you.
Try using my antivirus program one more time, please. It seems effective. That is, I wonder if my auto-learning program is doing even better than I thought it would, if it's working this well. Sorry, just talking to myself. Anyway, we've got other things to worry about. <laughs> Yukimura, I'm sorry. What were you so impatient for? You're not a kid anymore. Didn't you think for a second it might turn out like this? Because I've got nothing. I can't do anything. I just wanted to have something I could be sure about. Our friend here is obviously special, and Himari's so sure of herself. I'm the only one who's just... nothing. It was the same in the real world, too. I mean, not to brag or anything, but I did great at school and sports, and I could read people pretty well. I'm sure I was the kind of guy people would be jealous of. And of course, I appreciated that. But all the same, when I had to actually think about what I wanted to do in life, I realized I was just empty inside. Everyone would talk about their dreams and goals, and I'd just try and think of a single thing I really wanted to do. I had this vague picture of how I'd enjoy myself, find some job or other, get married or something, get older, and just have a pretty average, decent life. But suddenly I felt like my footing wasn't stable anymore and I started to panic, thinking I had to find something. And that was when I got summoned into the digital world. Here, I finally felt like I was special. I believed there was something only I could do. But it turned out I was wrong. I was sure of that after I met this tamer. I knew right away that I was just an empty nobody after all. And so I ended up mistreating my partner, the one I was supposed to care for more than anyone. And now, I'm the worst. I'm so stupid, so pathetic. It's true, that was pretty stupid of you. You've got a partner who believes in you and risks all kinds of danger for you no matter what. A bond so strong that even in altered form, they wouldn't lose sight of who you are. You've got friends who come running to your aid. And you still think you're a nobody? Uh. All this time, you never noticed that you had something no one else has in your hands all along. Uh. <laughs> I guess so, huh? I sure am an idiot. Looks like help came at just the right time. Let's get back to town for now. We need to let Yukimura get some rest. Yeah. Occupational hazard, I guess. He was trying too hard to put up a good front. As cool as he talked, he still relied on you so much. Not that I'm really one to talk. Hope you can give me a pass there. You ought to take a rest too. I have a feeling things are about to get pretty busy. So, the antivirus program opens up new possibilities for altered Digimon. Fascinating. Hey, perfect timing! Long time no see. Things have finally recovered to the point where we can send and receive video signals again. Thanks to all of you. I can't thank you enough. Still, I can't maintain this for long. Apologies, but let me get straight to the point. First, about the changes to the digital world. As you're aware, 
All of it stems from the spread of the BH program. I tried to look into ways to solve the problem, and that was when I managed to access the territory of this world. Changes in one world can sometimes ripple outward and affect other worlds for the worse. There have been times when the digital world began to creep into the real world, leading to disaster. Normally, that simply means we must address some issues that seem innocuous. But this has spiraled beyond my predictions. The BH program trapped me, and I almost ceased to exist altogether. As I was trying to shake things up, I happened to access the digital world's own self-purification function. Within that process, I discovered a way to digitize humans from the real world and draw them into the digital world. I see. So it was like what happened to me before. It's an emergency measure that the digital world can take in times of crisis, yes. So the fact that we were summoned here was... Yes. It was the will of the digital world. Huh? It was? I guess our connection from that tournament back in fifth grade was just coincidence then. The fact that I'm even able to connect and speak with you is due to your ability to resist the effects of the crisis. But it seems that our only hope against the BH program is for you and the Digimon to combine forces. That's right. We've been pulling our weight too. We've been working on Mr. Mameo's prototype antivirus program. And it's finally getting close to completion. I hadn't told you about this yet. Well, with everything that happened with Hamari and Koda, I realized my prototype might be more useful than I'd thought. I threw together a new one and gave it to Talmon, complete with the new test data. Yes, that test data was quite useful. An unexpected benefit of Kota and Himari's episodes, perhaps. Uh, <laughs> You're welcome? It looks like this world chose its helpers well when it summoned you. Only problem left is, how do we spread the antivirus program through the entirety of the digital world? There's a big mesh of underground network cables stretching all over the digital world. If we transmit the antivirus program from server tower, it ought to spread everywhere, no problem. The digital world's network isn't functioning properly right now, though. I suspect that a critical cable may have suffered some damage during that machine Draymond rampage. Simultaneous transmission won't be possible unless we can fix it. Then we'll need to pinpoint the damaged area. Let's ask Digimon from all over for information. Guess we've just got to tackle one problem at a time. Isn't that right? I'll gather information as well. I may not be able to operate freely just yet, but I can at least send Digimon.